Facebook has begun purging users. The reason? The very vague and indisputable excuse, you have violated community standards. But what does that mean? Is it hate speech? Speaking out against the government? Is it stuff we're not supposed to talk about? What is that? And why does Facebook get to decide? Despite their corporate status, the fact that they're a business providing a free service, they have become the commons, and they use people on their platform for financial gain. So it's not really free, is it? So why do they get to decide what can be said and what cannot? After 14 years of willing participation in Facebook's money-making service with no community strikes, in those 14 years, my account was disabled. They have disabled my account, like, completely. Like, if you go to my page, there's no face, there's no graphic, there's no nothing. So basically, 14 years of posting, um, you know, telling the 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 the, the uh, infrastructure telling Facebook where I am what I'm doing um, where I'm spending my money what I'm up to my thoughts my feelings my photos all my images that they claim to own right because that's what they say that they own your your image uh, all those things are down the memory hole down yeah, they're gone they're wiped out two days before my account was disabled I received a 24-hour block in which I could not comment on nor post content. This was the only time I had ever been reprimanded by Facebook. There was no warning and no reason given other than the violation of community standards, which means nothing. They made lots and lots of money from me participating in this. I have taught uh, numerous uh, machine learning data sets uh, tons of, of algorithmic information that will then be used in the future to build artificial intelligence to do, you know, any number of things. They gave me the opportunity to dispute the situation, but with no result. In the series of screens that are part of the dispute claim that you go through, they ask for your mobile phone number and an image of yourself. But after providing the information requested in the series of screens presented, the last screen states they can't review the dispute. And so they've captured your image, they've captured your phone number. Now, granted, they have all that, right? They have all that information, but now they have it in a new context, right? Uh, and what is going on here is, um, you know, you're, you're, you're now accused of doing something that you don't even know what it is. It's kangaroo court, right? Um, you don't know if you're now on a, on a no-fly list. You don't know if you're on a dissident list. You don't know because, I mean, the fucking Facebook is a CIA, right? Facebook claims that because of COVID-19, they don't have enough staff to review these disputes. That is a lie. Facebook doesn't need staff to review the disputes, and that's because Facebook has deployed artificial intelligence throughout their systems, and AI systems can easily handle the kinds of information that their systems ask for in order to prove your identity in the dispute. They won't tell you why you've been um, kicked out. Um, they just say that you breached community standards, which, you know, who knows what the fuck that means, right? You can click and link, you know, you can go read them, but they don't apply to what anything, because they don't, they don't tell you what you, you actually did. So now you're guilty. Um, by association, you're guilty of um, violating their community standards, which really violate, you know, First Amendment rights. This is more than censorship. This is singling out and identifying dissidents and people considered not worthy of participating in the public sphere, the commons, or everyday life. These are people who ask questions and say things that shouldn't be talked about. You're now guilty of by association. You're guilty of, of doing something that you're not sure what you did. And you're guilty of, you know, God knows what. And they're basically um, condemning you to um, the memory hole. Facebook 
is very deceptive in how they treat people who use their service. They lie and withhold information to manipulate people in order to gain information about them, information which can be exploited for money or information to give to the state. I have basically been dismissed as a bad employee, okay? And that's, that's basically it. And I have no uh, way of, um, you know, countering that or getting around that. So, um, and that's the way they want it. They want to shut us up. The rules of the community are not like ordinary social rules or laws based on human rights. They're based on the unwritten rules of behaving within a corporate setting. Of course, there are, you know, the human resource rules in a corporate setting. And then there are the social rules that are not written that can get an employee into trouble, whether they did something wrong or not. And that's because other people can say things about you that can get you fired or reprimanded or put on leave. People they don't want on their platform. Um, you know, we're now bad employees and we're being, we're basically being fired. And that's all there is to it.